The first trial match for 2022 is officially over and the Brisbane Broncos have done exactly what they set out to do and they have thrashed the Queensland Cup winning Manly Seagull side by nearly 50 points. It was a great display for the Broncos. I know it's a very weakened opposition to what they'll be playing come the NRL season and even the next few trial matches. But it's exactly what their fans would have wanted to see. It's basically guys who are going to be battling for positions, battling it out. And there wasn't really one bad play for the Broncos. Jordan Pierre has put his hand up to be a winger. Ezra Mann, while everyone's been talking about the other sixes, put his hand up to be a potential six. Billy Walters, he had an incredible game, but he did his best work as the number nine. So maybe utility could be his position for the short term. Tyson Gamble, he had a, he had his hand in a few tries, but overall he wasn't that impressive considering the talent that they were going up against. Maybe he could be a ball playing 13, that's what I thought. They've definitely beefed him up in the offseason. Obviously there weren't many standout players in this game. Tommy Flegler, he played, did have an error, but he did his job. It was just pretty much an outclassing for lack of a better word. And that's what you expect in these trial matches, especially these Queensland ones that the Broncos and the Titans get where they go up against these Queensland Cup sides. And it's smart. Unfortunately for Wyndham's Manly Seagulls, they don't have the caliber to compete with these guys. And it's good for Broncos' confidence to come out and smash a weakened side. But Brisbane, they did exactly what they would have wanted to do. And a few players have put their hands up for positions. Guys, let me know. Do you want me to do more recaps for trial matches in the future? But at least we have the All-Stars game later tonight.